I love your vibe. I love your energy. Stay tuned. Hi everyone, your creative educator here, and welcome to Sparks the Flames Education, where you get great science, math, and reading content, and really fun and creative ways of inspiring learning. Remember to subscribe, hit the notification so that you can see our new videos on Mondays. Like and share, and yes, subscribe. He just wrote. He just came in here. We talking math. We playing like this card game with math, and he's doing his number crunching. Show the number crunching. Thing. He's doing his number crunching. Where's the other number crunching paper? He's doing his number crunching because I'm over here doing some number crunching, <laughs> some stats and stuff. So he's number crunching and then he does this. E check equals MC he's like, square. check this out. Go ahead, tell what's this? It's e equals MC squared, which stands for energy equals mass times the speed of light. The speed of light squared, like seriously. Like, who does that? That's Albert solid. Einstein. Well, the inventor of E equals MC squared is Albert Einstein. That is so lit. Like, yo. I mean, I gotta give it up. I gotta give it. I did not see this coming, people. I did not. Like, this is just off the books, off you the rim. You can tell them that. You can tell them that. I'm telling them. I didn't see this coming. This is like, what? Well, now yeah. You got it? When you're doing one of these, mm -hmm. you tell me what it is and I can figure it out for you. And so then you just do the number crunching. And then I can and then I can show you and then you can type it in. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And today we did the sum. You remember the fancy sign for sum? It kind of Yes! E, it looks like an E! <laughs> I know it! I know it! Alright, we out, we out, we out, we out, we out, we out. We out. We over here, math lit. Oh, no. All right, peace out. You got something else. All right, let me, let me. Just a, a very cool concept to discuss and study. Energy, the idea of energy exists in many different cultures in different ways. Sometimes people call it chi, sometimes people call it pa. People call it all kinds of different things. In science, energy is represented by the letter E, and there are a whole bunch of different formulas that are used to kind of explain energy. And this just happens to be one of those cool ones that looks at the mass or the makeup of something and the speed of the light. Now mass just means all the particles that make up something. And the great thing about this is what it's really saying is that everything that exists has the potential to equal to energy because that's what mass is. Mass is just the particles that make up anything. So a box, a plant, anything. And those things have particles that can become energy, which is so cool. So anything has the potential to become energy. Now, the highest form or the fastest, I don't want to say highest, the fastest form of energy that scientists measure these days is light. So they use C to represent the speed of light. So energy E equals M mass times the speed of light squared. Because what they're really saying is that anything that exists has the potential to become energy, like light energy. Now there are a whole bunch of other types of energy, but this formula just talks about light energy. And it was just so cool how he just came out of the blue with that formula. Yeah, and like I said, even though we we're talking about the EMC square, which they attribute to Albert Einstein, um, the idea of energy exists in so many cultures, and they talk about it in different ways. But energy really is the ability to cause change, to cause things to move, the ability to cause things. And the great thing about energy is that energy gets transferred and transformed. Energy just moves from one substance to another substance or from one form to another form. So energy is just always. Energy is. Energy cannot, as they say, it cannot be created, it cannot be destroyed. So energy just is forever and forever. Shouts out to the original bubbler with your love and fire energy. Always. So thank y'all for watching. Check us out next week Monday when we'll have another video. Maybe another one about energy or something else. But please remember to like, share, and subscribe. Peace out.